Today I'm taking Tucker to a friend's arena and we're going to do some jumping. The catch is I just really want to practice trotting my jumps. I'm very bad at trotting jumps for whatever reason. I just think like the rhythm is off compared to cantering. <laughs> So today, that's what I'm gonna be working on and I thought we could just have some fun with it. I'm gonna start with just a few small warm-up jumps and then I'm gonna try a Chase Me Charlie but trotting. So I got a few like cross rails and cavalettis set up and we'll start there. Look up, oh gosh, good boy. I guess trotting jumps is probably just like cantering jumps. I just need to count my strides, okay? One, two, one, two, oh man. If y'all see what I'm doing wrong, I need you to comment down below and tell me because <laughs> I don't know what it is, just the rhythm of the trot, I guess, compared to the canter. I just do not know when to expect the horse to jump. Then I'm like, I'm not really supposed to expect anything. I'm just supposed to go with the horse, but I think I'm just getting way too much in my head. Look up, good boy. So this is gonna be our Chase Me Charlie jump. If you don't know what Chase Me Charlie is, it's basically you go over the jump and if you make it over without knocking it, then you raise it and then you just keep raising it until you know you go as high as you can. If I feel like it gets to the point where it's too big to safely jump it, we'll stop. Just so y'all kind of have a reference, Tucker is 13-1 and I think right now this jump is probably 18 inches, maybe a little under 18 inches. So that's where we're starting. All right, 18 inches, here we go. Good boy. This is the next hole up. Oh gosh, oh no, I knocked it down, second try. That was totally my bad, I totally rushed him. Second attempt, and I bet he's gonna jump this big because he does not like hitting jumps. Look up, good boy. Here's where we're at, I think it's probably two feet or two three, and Tucker is feeling good. As you can see, he wants to move around, I think he's enjoying this and he's getting pretty forward. Like I think he knows the jumps are going up. So we're gonna do this and see how it goes. I rushed him a little bit over the last one. So I need to not do this. I'm gonna just let him go. Oh. So this is probably two, three, two, six, two, three. I don't know. He sees it, let's see. Good oh boy, we hit that, but we didn't knock it. I think Tucker's getting to where he's trying to figure out how to do the jump. He's seeing that they're getting bigger, and I can just tell on approach, he's a little like, do I keep trying, do I canter? So I just really have to be encouraging to him. We're gonna go up the other hole, and it's getting bigger. I'm gonna say this next one's gonna be probably two six, and so I just gotta make sure I ride him pretty forward. If he gets a canter stride in there, you know, it's okay. All right, I want to be brave. Oh, but I don't feel brave. Look up, forward, tuck forward. Oh shoot, no! Uh, so I was very indecisive about that jump and I think that's why we knocked it down. I don't think that was anything with Tucker. He was just going off of me. So I wanna try it again because I don't feel like it was dangerous or anything. I just wanna see if we can get over it and if we can continue, so let's do it. <laughs> if you're looking for a gift for someone or you just wanna support our channel, we actually have an Equine Helper Etsy store where every day Colin and I are making designs and putting them on t-shirts and sweatshirts. If you are interested in that, we'll put the link in the description to the Etsy store. Y'all, I don't know how much more I'll be able to do after this because this one's freaking me out. All right, Tucker knows what he's doing now though. Good boy. That was ugly on my part, but I think one reason maybe I have a problem with trotting jumps is because in trotting, the stride is probably gonna get a lot closer to the jump compared to cantering. And so when we're coming up to the jump and I'm like, he still has a few more steps, but we just seem so close. I think maybe that's where I'm wigging out a little bit, but I think I can do at least one more hole. So we'll probably be at like two, six, two, nine. I don't have the measuring tape. So I'm gonna say two, six or two, nine. Ah, uh, I'm nervous guys, I'm nervous. Oh gosh, I got thrown out of the saddle. Honestly, we are actually getting closer to as high as Tucker has ever jumped. He hasn't done anything too crazy, like two, nine, three feet. So I wanna do that one again, just make sure we're confident and I'm confident before we raise it up. Cause once we raise it, we should probably be around three feet. And while that one felt good and he's, he got his canter stride before, and I think that's what helped, but I still felt like I kinda got thrown out of the saddle. So I just wanna make sure my seat is good. 
I need to grab me. Holy heck! I got way up in his mouth. I feel so bad. It's all me though. Like he is going over it so well. I just need to relax. If we can't get this right this time, we're gonna stop here. I just need to grab Maine because at least then I won't get him in the mouth. So I'm gonna just go ahead and do that. Grabbing Maine. Oh, Tucker, that's me, that's me. We got it, buddy. We got it, we got it, you got it. Ah, I'm scared now. We can do it. No, don't, don't push that off. I just gotta ride forward. I, I'm just gonna get my two point. We got it, bud, we got it. Good boy. I think we're gonna stop here with this just because it's getting to the point where I am not confident and Tucker's picking up on me, so he's not really confident either. I am proud of him though that we were able to do this. Anyway, we're gonna go out on the trail now and cool out and maybe gallop around a little bit before just because Tucker was so good and he loves to gallop. As I mentioned earlier, if you have any tips or tricks for trotting jumps, just leave it down in the comments. I would love to try it. And if you found this video enjoyable, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more weekly horse videos.